I wanted to show you unshaved armpits. <laughs> Today I want to show you how to play a violin on a branch. get there in a minute. Now let's continue from where we ended in my last video. So after two months of heavy snow and freezing cold, we were having an unexpected heat wave with the temperatures perhaps not too suitable for sunbathing, but warm enough to melt almost all of the snow. But just as I was about to get excited about spring arriving early, the snow returned, making all white again. One good thing about snow and frost is that the roads become drivable again. I could finally drive out to do my grocery shopping. Okay, that's shopping then. I thought it's a long time I haven't shown you what I buy. And so this is kind of like uh, hmm, a bit exception because I haven't been out for a while and so I wanted to treat myself. And so I got my mm, cakes with some black currants and cream and uh, butter biscuits with hazelnuts, Kinder Bueno, uh, sourdough loaf, smoked salmon, cheese, mayo, uh, cheesecakes, yogurt, milk, some vegetables, some snow crab. I'm so happy because I haven't had chance to buy anything for a long time and so I was like coping with what I have at home which uh, I do have a lot, plenty still, so much supplies, just so much supplies and some more supplies here look some sweets and nibbles and things <laughs> I take. Give me, I take. I take. Lotti, 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 lotti. Today is minus 17 degrees. <laughs> oh, we don't care, we don't care, we play football, we play football. You can't squeeze it anymore because it's frozen. It's rock hard. Yeah, it's frozen. <laughs> it's rock hard. Inside it is, whoa, 21 degrees, amazing. But what's the situation out here? The situation is pretty scary, man. See, I've got my dinner, but I don't need fridge, man, because in here, with the heater on, 
I am managing to keep it above zero degrees. So all this food, which is up here, doesn't freeze. But the situation in here, where there is a toilet, is pretty bad. The toilet is frozen. And so I am using the good old outdoor toilet. It's really not pleasant when you need to go and outside it's minus 17. Yeah, anyways. What is it? Go see. Go see. What is it? Nicely sit. Yes. Yeah. Nice. Come on, man. Nice. Nice. <coughs> Another good thing about cold temperatures is that it can come with some sunshine, which is always so welcomed, as most of the winter days in this part of the world are cloudy, gray and pretty gloomy. for biscuits as well I know nice biscuits and Snoopy is waiting for the cake yeah in the oven you got cake in the oven Snoopy yeah okay what kind of cake is that apple cake isn't it mm -hmm. what is that an apple cake you want cake as well you want you want You want a cake? You want?
but just as we were settling for the cold weather heat wave returned oh my god whoa the ice is broken into the lake and it looks very weird isn't it The temperatures were positive for a few days, making some of the snow and ice melt, bringing floods across the country. Some areas being affected on a dramatic scale and hundreds of people had to be evacuated from their flooded homes. Look, even the waters of this small forest river rose just in one night. Luckily, this river is deep down in a valley and would never be able to do too much damage. Hello, Snoopy. Hello, Sippy. Okay, walkies. Come on then. Come on then. No. Give me. Give me. No, it's mine. It's mine. It's mine. Give me. Give me. It's mine. No. Give me. It's mine. It's mine. Give me. Give me, I put. No, I put. I put. No, no. Oh, it's mine. Again, the same situation. Ice is very, very slippery, and uh, you wouldn't want to drive on these such roads. And that's the thing, they keep uh, roads maintained uh, with salt and sand and what else uh, in towns and cities, but like countrysides, villages, it's not important, I suppose. So, People can't drive, and most of the people don't have these studded tires. Yeah, and we are one of those people. So we are stuck again, eh? We are stuck again. Snacky time. Nice. Nice. And to be honest, whatever happens, it normally happens in or close to towns and cities. Here in the countryside, things go considerably smoothly. Life goes on, and what a life this is. Then, funny enough, snow and frost returned. There is a moon, man. <coughs> Here's one of our evening walks. So magical, so magical, wow, imagine ice skating there and then put some music on and it's like, 
Whoa, is it even real? Whoa. And the moon here. There's the moon over there. What else do you want? December it was dark quarter past four so yeah it's nice to see the daylight still at five o'clock mushroom hot dog and that's how big is the coffee like this like super large I mean okay let's put let's put so we got sugar so they have syrups Hazelnut, caramel, vanilla, they also have option of cinnamon or chocolate. Okay, let's go for chocolate, eh? Loads of chocolates. I need chocolate in my life today. Yeah, basically, this is it. It's my favorite coffee. And it needs to be extra large for me to be willing to pay money for it. Hello, sweetheart. You all right? Good boy. Okay, let's go. Let's go. You're sitting very nicely, like a human. Are you a human? You're a human? <laughs> it's not gonna change it's not gonna change well the winter here in latvia is uh, very long and it can last until end of april uh, that was the case last year when i bought the farm uh, i bought it in uh, april end of march anyways uh, in mid-april it was still snowing so yeah um anyways i feel like uh, i want to take a break i want to take a break from all the projects from the renovation so if i feel like not doing something like i'm done with something i should stop and so i will unless i feel like doing something again there in the cottage and then of course filming it but otherwise i will just take a little break from the projects from the cottage projects i mean uh, what i'm gonna do until the bloody spring comes um uh, well uh, to be honest, I am really fed up of winter. <laughs> I'm not the person who complains normally. Oh well. So, it's a pretty nice log cabin actually. Hola! And so, where do we go from here? And yeah, so in winter, it kind of looks the same, everything. Like, I mean, would you be able to tell there is a lake if I didn't tell you? Like, it's the same. It's white. 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 Everything is white. Well, why it can be great if you use it as a background for something and want to make colors to pop out a lot better. But otherwise, there's not much to see apart from white. And although it is beautiful, I mean, I mean, for how long you can see white? For how long? <sighs> Oh, it's actually it doesn't taste that bad. Snoopy! 
but that's not how we should look at things. I need to look for what I would love to do instead rather than dwell on things which I don't like. And so yeah, I am working now on uh, my music projects and uh, I was surprised finding them actually. And, and wow, some of the songs are pretty, pretty good. <laughs> Music has always been a big part of my life. Almost all our family members and a lot of friends play music. I particularly don't play any instrument properly, but that doesn't stop me from playing them. Especially I love weird instruments which are either tribal instruments, self-made or no instruments at all. <laughs> For example, earrings like this, as you move the sound and you can do a shamanic dance without uh, playing any other instruments. Whatever sounds great, I will use and improvise. Perhaps I take after my brother. <laughs> Band. All my music and songs you can find on SoundCloud as well as in my music playlist. You will find the links in the description. The question to ask here myself is if this was my last day of my life. What would I do? Definitely not stuck at the cottage. Definitely not. It's not gonna happen. Come on, Snoopy. So the plan is, the plan is, let me show you one minute. I'll show you what my plan is. Okay, so this will do. Okay. So the plan. You know, I never have a plan, really. I just go with the flow, with the feelings, see what happens. But how to spend the rest of my life? Okay, let's see what happens. All right, so I'm doing that. So, what do you reckon, Snoopy? What do we feel like doing? What are we feeling excited about? What makes us wanting to get out of the bed in the morning? What is that thing? Ready, Snoopy? Come on then! 